on the Outdoor Food Factory TV with Isaac Walker from the Ike and Rome Show. Mr. Walker, you've been in, uh, in the grassroots basketball scene. Yeah, yeah, exactly, for quite a while now. Uh, we're here at the Man Shop from your Shea Con yes, and, Shea. and Shea, especially back in the early 90s, was kind of the premier athlete amongst AAU basketball players, and now we're seeing that just being kind of more of the norm. Yeah. How do you think the AAU basketball you know, kind of scene has grown, and do you think it's grown for better? I, I, I do think it's grown for better. Man. You see a lot of these young guys at a young age, not only guys, but the girls out here developing their skills. They're, they're able to harness the basketball skills of the guys from the main high school college. Now, back in the day, it was so much fun. And they were playing ball with this and all those guys. But the travel is good. But then you do have rules out there, man. You need to protect our babies. And that's one thing we do with the Ike and Roll Show, man, just trying to promote levels with the high school sports. Uh, just put all the kids and the girls, you know, just make sure they are doing the right thing. Straight up, scare them in a positive direction. And there is a bunch of coaches doing the right thing. I know you know, oftentimes you have coaches on your, your show. Um, and it's hard because there are, like you say, those rules out there. But oftentimes these coaches end up becoming almost like a father figure to these kids. Yes, children. yes. Well, the, the time that they spend with the travel ball coaches are sometimes a little bit more than the high school. So they're working on their development skills, teamwork, weekends, summertime, travel ball time. So if I was a college coach, I would probably have to talk to an AAU coach. And just to just uh, study the character, you know, the kids, because that's very important. The character, the term, integrity, and seeing the college and the to if they're fit. And with the increased exposure, we've also seen like players who maybe were just kind of marginal talents. Who, for instance, you mentioned women. We're seeing much more, you know, money put into women's athletics. I mean, that is kind of one of the positives that we've seen in the years, hasn't it? Any, any time, any game, a lot of our kids see an opportunity to go to the next level in college to better themselves as a human being in society. We live in this country. All of that is possible. So our girls out there just doing well, keep pushing. Our boys is doing well, keep pushing. Our coaches, thank you, man. You're gonna always have negative people around, but that's all we call the negativity. We keep pushing. Around. People like it's a lot of positive people, man. Like you, what you're doing, Shay Cotton. Just keep pushing, man. We need these guys to keep playing basketball to get out of the situation. It's a bit.